for me, it's been like uh, discovering who I am. Uh, it has helped me build self-awareness to be able to become more aware of the people that surround me. I believe that we have to embrace, again, a we attitude. There is no I in team, and teams are built when people work together. We have to challenge ourselves to move ourselves into a direction where we can be in some of those leadership positions and, and not necessarily to be in a leadership position to take control, but to offer perspective. Equality for all, uh, making sure that um, everyone is well represented and, if you will, kind of at the table and that we're advocating for, for one another. I think that's truly what we, we want to get at and, and as a community want to be. Well, for someone who's been asked to be a participant, I think it's just a, a wonderful and unique opportunity to develop yourself as an, an individual, but also um, as a leader in the community. You have a chance to interact with up-and-coming other pr professionals. Uh, I think I've, know, I've discovered that all of the participants have become very close, support each other. That network in itself is really beneficial. But you also have a chance to interact with leaders in our community who are giving of their time. That interaction, I think, is, is, is vital uh, for the development of an individual as a leader. Knowing that what Steve has accomplished in his life, um, I, I want to I wanna try to do the same thing. Uh, Steve grew up right here in, in Bloomington, Illinois, um, Illinois Wesleyan graduate. And uh, get that in. You gotta, gotta, gotta get that in. Get, get the Titans have, in. Have there to somewhere. get that in. And um, uh, I'm just I've been very impressed at the connections, um, the the people that that, that Steve has uh, come into contact with, those lives that he's touched. And I, I, I just I'm inspired because I want to do the same thing. The MCLP group was a very energetic group, um, and I found them to be incredibly curious. Uh, they're very inquisitive and uh, eager to apply what they're learning in the program. They know far more about our community than they did going into it. And I suspect it probably uh, significantly broadened their network and enriched the relationships that they have with professionals in the community. Amazing. Like I said, for me it's been uh, discovering who I am, uh, what I believe in, and it's been uh, I've learned so much about leadership courage and standing up for what I believe in. Uh, I've grown in so many different ways. I, I use my leadership skills now not only at home but at work and something that I'll never forget. It's been a very valuable experience for me. When I entered this program, I was, I was eye-opening to see the poverty simulation. Going through that uh, was very eye-opening. Uh, from the standpoint that I've got to, to kind of feel what those who are less fortunate than me uh, go through on a daily basis. I've grown tremendously from being in the program. I think that um, having been somebody who was raised in Bloomington Normal, um, I, I thought I had a good idea of the culture of Bloomington Normal, the, the kind of the politics, I guess, if you would say, of Bloomington Normal. Um, but the program has really kind of enlightened me and kind of challenged me to think a little bit differently. Because they're learning a lot of things and that means that some, something I've heard before, once the mind is stretched, it never goes back to its original form. And I think this is the way it will work with each person who's attending.